Welcome back, I'm Justin Carney. And I'm Sean Sturba. Uh, today we wanted to talk to you a little bit about um, our flooring and the flooring that we put into the house. Uh, what we're looking at as far as punching out the house as soon as the flooring is installed. So we want to take you around and show you a few things that we're looking for uh, with regards to your carpet, uh, any hard surface flooring, your vinyl or, or tile, and as well as any wood that might be installed in your new home. Let's go take a look. Uh, one of the selections that we offer is our uh, scraped wood look, which you can see here in the kitchen dinette area of this plan. Uh, a few things that we're looking for in our wood floors, we want to make sure obviously that all the pieces are, are uh, fit tightly together as you can see here on the floor uh, that we're standing on. Uh, we also what we're looking for is where we butt up our wood floor into our cabinets. Uh, we want to make sure that we leave a space as required by the manufacturer to ac accommodate for any uh, expansion and contraction that might happen during the changes in climate that we experience here in Nebraska. And then we cover that gap with a piece of scribe molding here, as you can see on this cabinet. Uh, up against the baseboard, which you can see over here to my left, is we cover this area uh, with a piece of base shoe. And that covers uh, the, the gap that we uh, purposely leave up against the wall to allow for that expansion and contraction. With ceramic tile, we actually put down the uh, plywood uh, underlayment before the uh, tile goes down. Ceramic tile's all uh, mastic into place. And then there's a spacer, um, usually about a quarter inch grout lines, what we use on our floor tiles. Uh, the tiles themselves um, will be close to the baseboard, but not completely tight, so there'll be a slight gap. And in that case, we just cover that with a uh, piece of uh, quarter round right there, base shoe. Um, so we got the quarter round here, um, kind of sealing up that gap between the tile and the baseboard. Um, the tile themselves is a porcelain tile, so it's not going to absorb any uh, dirt or get stained. However, the grout joints here will need to be uh, sealed up with a grout sealer. Um, if you had dirt, um, any kind of liquids with colors could stain that. So the grout joints themselves, you'll seal or um, seal them up, but the tiles themselves do not. And then we'll go to Justin for the next floor surface. And I just wanted to briefly talk about carpet. Um, you can see the frise carpet that's installed here in this home. A few things that we're looking for after the guys are done installing. We want to make sure, obviously, that the carpet is tucked nice and tight up against any tile surfaces that we have, hard surface flooring. Um, and then as well, check for any seams. For instance, in the doorway here in front of me, uh, you can see there is a seam here, which is in completely invisible, which is what we're looking for. But there is a seam uh, across this doorway to separate the two rooms as these pieces come out on separate rolls and need to be cut separately. So uh, those are a few things that we're looking for as far as our carpet is concerned. Uh, and then we'll take a look at uh, the vinyl surface in your house. Your vinyl flooring is also on an underlayment, um, basically that quarter inch underlayment. It kind of gives that uh, floor surface a little movement so it doesn't uh, um, show through the floor itself. Um, with the vinyl flooring, uh, the installers are just checking to make sure that they've uh, scraped and uh, removed any type of uh, foreign uh, debris or particles on there. And then they uh, fill all the joints with a filler. And then typically the vinyl is held tight to the wall and then they describe it to that so it's a good fit. Um, other than that, um, it's a very durable surface and um, you know just use a mild detergent when cleaning it. Thanks for joining us today to talk about the uh, flooring surfaces of your home. Hopefully you've learned a few things about your vinyl, carpet, uh, hardwood, and uh, any tile surfaces in your house. Uh, feel free to visit us at our models in Portal Ridge or Saddlebrook or on the web at charlestonhomesomaha.com. Thanks. Thank you.